So I told you, whenever we are sending the goods at invoice price, we'll have to pass two additional entries. Why we'll get the additional entries? Because if you don't pass the additional entries, we'll not know cut profit or loss. When you send the goods at invoice price, we'll not know cut profit or loss. What is the first entry we are writing? Consignment account data to goods sent on consignment. These for sending the goods. The cost price is what 10,000, but the invoice price is what 12,000. So whenever we are sending the goods at what invoice price to the agent, we are sending at what 12,000. How much is the extra profit we add? The difference between cost price and invoice price is what loading. So whenever we add extra price, we will not know cut profit or loss. So what we need to do? So we need to pass an additional entry. First is for what? Sending the goods. When you send the goods at the invoice price, that has to be unloaded by writing the reverse entry. Goods sent on consignment account it to consignment. Whatever extra you are adding, that will be unloaded on writing. This is the entry. First, when you send the goods, consignment to goods sent on consignment. For unloading the goods sent, goods sent on consignment to consignment. So this is the additional entry which we have to pass when the goods are sent at what? Invoice price. Now next reason is what? When you send the goods at what? Invoice price. For the agent, he will value the goods at, if there is any unsold stock, he will value the goods at 12,000. Because we have sent the goods at 12,000, if there is any unsold stock, he will value the goods at what? 12,000. So this is also invoice price. So what we have to do? For this we have to pass an one more entry. What is the entry for unsold stock? Consignment stock account data to consignment. For unloading it, we have to pass consignment account data to consignment stock reserve. This is for unloading of goods sent. Unloading of goods sent. This is for unloading of unsold stock. And remember this entry will not come when there is no unsold stock. So whenever we send the goods at invoice price, that unloading has to be done by writing the reverse entry. Goods sent on consignment to consignment. And whenever we value the goods at what? Invoice price. Unsold stock, if the unsold stock is valued at invoice price, for that we need to pass what? Consignment account to consignment stock reserve. This for what? Unloading of unsold stock. 